find the tenth term of the following geometric sequence. So the first thing we want to do is recognize that it's a geometric sequence and it's asking us to find the tenth term but we only have four terms here. So because we don't have the previous term which is the ninth term, we're going to need to use an explicit formula because we have the starting value. So a couple of things we need to do, we need to write the explicit formula and we need to find the common ratio. Remember that our common ratio R is equal to our second term divided by our first term which is going to be 35 divided by 7 which is equal to 5. And then if you recall from our geometric sequences explicit formulas if we ha want any term it is going to be equal to our first term or starting value multiplied by our common ratio that is raised to the previous term. So if we write that out in terms of a sub n, term is going to be described by a sub n. Our first term would be a sub 1. And then we would have our common ratio raised to the previous term. The previous term, the one right before n, would be to the n minus 1. And that's the general explicit formula for a geometric sequence. And now we can plug in what we do know in order to find the specific explicit formula for this sequence and then find our tenth term. So we are looking for our tenth term. So we will go ahead and plug in a sub 10. Our first term in the sequence is 7, so we can plug that in. We know that our common ratio is 5, so we can plug that in. And then the previous term to 10 would just be 9. So then we can solve that algebraically. It is equal to 7 times 5 to the 9th, which if you plug that into your calculator, is going to be 1,953,000. 125. When you multiply that by 7, it becomes 13,671,875. And that is our tenth term.